Hello, my lovely Misfitians, and welcome back to another video. So if I sound a little bit congested, I am kind of stuffy right now, so I apologize for that. Um, last week, I took the week off just for mental health reasons. I needed to process a lot of the stuff that I've been kind of <laughs> going through um, for the past couple of weeks. So I took last week off, but... After thinking about it last week, I did want to do something art related that would help me kind of relax. And this is kind of what I came up with. So for me, color mixing has always been very relaxing and soothing. So I decided to take color concepts. And for this week, I'm going to be doing flamingo pinks and then choose an assortment of colors that I think would work really well as gradients and then lay those down in a chart form that I can refer to later on. So even though I'm not painting a full illustration, I'm still exploring basically color concepts and what works and what doesn't for future illustrations. Plus this project really only takes about 30 minutes, which right now time is very limited for me. Plus, I don't have a ton of energy recently, so um, this has been very, very nice to just kind of have on the side that I can do, where I feel like I'm being productive in my art, but at the same time, I'm not stressing out over it. Now, I've done this a lot. Y'all have probably noticed it, but I've never done it in these small little bite chunk charts before, so I wanted to create a small little notebook and really concentrate on specific color concepts. And this is what I came up with for this week. So the ideas was basically flamingo pinks or more of those pink tropical colors. And I just explored different ways to mix those together in gradients. The two main colors that I used were Brilliant Pink as well as Shell Pink from Holbin. Those two pinks are probably my favorite when I'm ever painting something that has those flamingo pink colors. And this is just a small mini notebook that I can put that chart into a protective sleeve and store away for later on. So that's kind of the concept of what I did this week. Here's a quick baby bump update. I will say he is healthy right now. Everything is okay for right now and we're hoping that it continues to go well for the future. So thanks for your patience y'all and lots of love. I will see you next time.